끓어요. video this is actually the same day that I'm recording this um, but I changed because we're about to leave to go to Goodwill to donate all this stuff I bagged it up I have a total of four bags so that's pretty good um, yeah so we're gonna donate it and then I'm gonna go inside and see if there's anything cool in there that I like Vera and Vivo <sighs> chasing each other Anyways, um, yeah, I'm Alexis. If you're new, go ahead and go check out the last video of me cleaning out my closet. It was really fun. Um, fun for y'all, not fun for me. But um, yeah, let's let's go to Goodwill. Yay, Sarah. Why? You always cry. She's always crying. Always crying, been walked, been fed. Water. All of it. Still crying, aren't ya? <laughs> Let's go. Okay, I just got to Goodwill. Goodwill. Um, I'm gonna drop off the bags in the back and then go inside and see if they have anything cool. I always like going to Goodwill because it, they're also different based on like the location that they're in. So I haven't been to a Goodwill in Houston yet. So I'm kind of excited because Houston is fire. People are stylish as fuck. So I'm excited. Um, yeah, I probably won't do anything in there like sh I might show y'all like some stuff I'm picking but I'm not gonna like yeah no um I'll just show y'all when I get home if I get anything so let's go inside <laughs> what is bye <laughs> I did end up getting some stuff. This like red car is shining on my face. It's making it red. Okay, I pulled up so that red car wasn't shining on my face anymore, but I just got out of Goodwill. I did get a couple things, um, and I'm trying to decide if like now I'm in the mood to go to another thrift store or if like I'm kind of over it. And I'm thinking about doing something that I haven't done in a really long time, if ever. And that's getting another coffee. Like, I had one coffee today, and I, that's, like, literally all I ever have is, like, one. And there's a Dunkin', like, right there. And, like, I haven't seen a Dunkin' in a minute. Come to mama. But I already had coffee today and that's not good. I have anxiety. <laughs> coffee is not good when you have anxiety. Um, but I'm feeling like really calm and like everyone, oh my gosh. Okay, I was about to say everyone in there was so nice. But I was in there and like I'm very observant of my surroundings when I'm out in public because I'm literally my worst nightmare is being kidnapped and so like I oh my god that girl's hair is literally so pretty wow gorgeous gorgeous she has more hair than I've ever had in my life and she's like eight um anyways distracted what was I saying oh yeah so I was inside and I was like being very observant, like kind of shitting myself as I do when I first go anywhere. I'm like, what the fuck? People are trying to steal me. Um, but no, I think that's also just being a woman in America. I said it, I said it, I said it. But anyways, um, I was in there and I was in the men's section because I 
always go to the men's section first because the women's section is just not my vibe usually and so I went to the men's section and there was a guy in there and he was like in suits and he was on the phone and he was like I'm looking for suitcases like let me get off the phone let me get out of here I'm looking for suitcases but he wasn't by the suitcases he was by the clothes and he was like well at least you don't have scars on your face like me and so I'm like looking at him and I'm trying not to be I'm trying to mind my business but like I couldn't really because he kept passing back and forth and when I heard like at least you don't have scars on your face I was like whoa and um so then I'm like going through the graphic tees well not graphic tees the t-shirts trying to look for a graphic tee and he's like standing across the aisle and he's like well um let me hurry up and get off this phone and get out of here and then he was like he said well my scars are from the suicide bombing and I was like what what is happening and I don't know I was like he like said it loud it was like he was pranking someone or it was like I was on an episode of what would you do and like there was cameras I don't know it was so weird but like he literally was like well my scars are from the suicide bombing and I was like what suicide bombing are we talking about <laughs> but anyways that was interesting um yeah maybe I should go to another Goodwill or like a Salvation Army or I don't know I don't need another coffee also I'm just gonna throw this in this video comment below that's so dumb because I have like five subscribers but to the people who watch my videos I I am so happy and I don't even know who you are but I'm so happy you watch them and I love making videos so um I just do it I don't really do it so that people watch it I just genuinely love creating this content um that sounds like I'm lying and like I'm being fake but like I'm dead ass like I've been trying to do this for like four years and I just haven't had the time but now I have the time and I am really like passionate about it and I really like making videos and I love YouTube I l watch YouTube more than anything else and it's just like therapeutic for me to watch other people's lives and I want to be a part of that and I love being on camera and like just doing fun shit because this makes me do fun shit. But anyways, um, <laughs> that was so dramatic. But what I was saying is that I want to go to either Starbucks or like I go to Dunkin Donuts or like anywhere and try their like fall shit. So let me know if y'all want to see that whoever you are and if you don't I'm probably still gonna do it so maybe say you don't want me to do that if you don't want me to do it the lighting right here is atrocious but I just want to say I did in fact get this it's the pumpkin spice signature ice latte let's try it yeah yeah Hi, I'm I didn't find anything in that store. But I'm like tired. Thrifting it takes a lot of energy. Like I went through the whole store and I had a whole bunch of stuff and then I tried it on and none of it looked right, none of it fit because you'll find something really cute and you're like, oh, it, it might fit, but then it's like, 
way too big or too small or whatever. But uh, I'm gonna show you what I got. Let me turn this off. I'm about to burn up though. Let me show you what I got from Goodwill. And then I'm going home because I'm tired. Okay, so the first thing I got was this purse. I thought this was so cute. I like the shape of it. And it's like really big. Um, then I got this like plain black shirt. It says Gianni Versace. Is that real? Probably not. <laughs> I don't know. And then I got some sweatpants, some black, plain Russell, good old sweatpants. Can't go wrong with that. And then I got this really cute sweater that has a stain on it that hopefully comes out. But how cute is this and comfy and cozy for the winter? Yeah, that's all I got. It wasn't very successful. I really wanted to get some cargo pants and some camo pants. I really need pants. Like, I have no cool pants, but I'm just going to have to buy some. Because thrifting, they're just... It's rare you're going to find something that fits just right. You know? So, yeah. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if I buy some fall clothes, I'm sure I'll do like a haul. And keep y'all updated on what my wardrobe is looking like after the clean out. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this short video of me thrifting boring it's literally gonna be like 10 minutes long probably but anyways uh i'll see y'all in the next one bye